Building robots can be a challenging, expensive and time-consuming task that involves many people. Traditionally, design methods have followed a top-down strategy whereby the performance requirements of the robot were explicitly defined at the beginning and then solved through a decomposition process. While top-down methods have high efficiency, they are difficult to apply in more fuzzy settings where it is not possible to predetermine exact design criteria. For example, a disaster response robot may be required to traverse a wide range of unpredictable ground conditions. In such cases, it might be more appropriate to design the robot in a bottom-up way, whereby the system is designed with an emphasis on adaptability and flexibility in use. While there are several bottom-up approaches that are commonly used in robotics, they are based on abstract design principles, which can be difficult to apply in a systematic way. This research is motivated by the need to develop more formal approaches to design robots using a bottom-up approach. Our research explores how the goals question metrics method, or simply GQM, can be adopted for use in design applications involving robots. GQM was not conceived originally for design. Rather, it was devised as an evaluation tool to help engineers and project managers on complex projects like space missions decide what they needed to measure in order to ascertain if they had achieved high-level objectives. The method is goal-orientated because it begins with goal setting, which involves identifying important but sometimes abstract system requirements. Next, questions are posed based on what knowledge is needed to ascertain if a goal has been accomplished. These questions typically seek to explore the validity of a hypothesis or a model. Finally, suitable metrics are defined based on these questions. Using data collected over the course of the project, an evaluation is performed to investigate the ability of the system to attain the defined metrics. These results can then be interpreted with respect to the underlying questions that were posed. The process of determining if a goal has been accomplished then involves examining the degree to which the questions were satisfied. In this way, metrics are defined systematically in a top-down fashion, while the interpretation of measurement data is done bottom-up. In this paper, we define a structured, three-phase process for adapting GQM for applications in robot design. This new method, which we call DGQM, is applied to a robot design use case that involved developing a highly adaptable gripper for a general purpose service robot. The process involved first identifying high-level design goals as well as corresponding questions and metrics. In the planning phase, a design concept was formulated that addressed a significant subset of these goals. This led to the development of a prototype embodiment and collection of metrics data which was subsequently used in evaluation. As bottom-up design is iterative in nature, it is anticipated that the number of goals addressed by the design will increase with each iteration. Our research indicates that DGQM may provide a useful tool in robot design applications, although more case studies are needed to better understand the full extent of its usefulness.